Hey everyone, this is Manly Badass Hero, and welcome to Search Party Director's Cut, a retro style horror game published by Public Combo, where you try to survive a slasher villain in his weird house. So I've played one other video on this. I played the prologue. This will be the main game that stars the sister of the prologue's pro tag. And this is also a semi-remake, kind of update upgrade of a older release game that has new endings and some new areas. Newspapers date October 11th, 1991. Yesterday afternoon, an eight-year-old Daniel Harrison went missing. He was last seen heading through Bluebell Woods, just off Blair Road at 2.10 p.m. Well, that's why the kid called himself Blair. Hmm. He just, like, saw the road and he's like, oh, my name is Blair. Traveling alone, he was taking a shortcut home after school. Police collaborated with the community and conducted a search party for Daniel at 5 p.m. At 5.35 p.m., Daniel's sister, 16-year-old Claire Harrison, also went missing for several hours. She was accompanied by her mother, Cynthia Harrison, 39, and police officer Brendan Smith, 37, when she wandered off into the woods on her own. Claire, what? The rest is missing. Now it's up to you, the player, to determine her fate. There we go. So in the prologue, Daniel met an unfortunate end. Let's see what happens to him in the end. Mom? 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 How did I get lost? I didn't think this force was that big. Pause the game. Is that a house up ahead? Maybe Daniel's inside. Hold the sprint. Hold a look around. So here's a crate that we could break. Let's remember that. Let's start from the left. Got an old axe. Attack use item. Cycle for inventory. Looks like this car is going to be our escape route, or at least one of them. This is a multiple ending game. There is five total endings, supposedly. Whoa. We are in a corpse party situation where we cannot leave. And we are stuck to this house. Now, Daniel went around this way. Okay. Now I want to go around. Pull cutters, so we do have to go in through the place of the crate. Let's go in. Now I vaguely remember the layout. Probably similar. I'm locked in. So yeah, so there's the door Daniel came in. Here's the kitchen. I'm gonna kick these balls around because I can. One plate is broken. Daniel unlocked this. Living room key. Need bolt cutters. Okay. This room is now locked from the other side. Interesting. Now the living room is already... Hold up, can I lock it? Maybe not. Living room is already locked. Or rather unlocked. Uh, so I'm not sure what the key would be used for here. Bunny? Get the smile. Money. Yeah, that's a nice detail. Every room that Daniel unlocked is unlocked right now. I feel really safe in this room. 
the living room key for the moment. Save game. Okay, so we actually can save in this game. And we need the house key for that. Lock from the other side. Smack money! Maybe I should have saved that for something more important. House key. We may be attacked over here. Oh, we can go in the attic. Huh. More money. It's a painting of a blue door. There's something strange about it. Hmm. The door kind of makes me think of Daniel's ending when he saw a door before he went to the other dimension. You know, a shadow realm. A missing person poster. This one is from July 30th. 13th forever, 1989. Need an attic key. This world ain't so happy. Missing person poster, August 6, 1990. A bunch of missing persons posters. Who? Someone died. My god. Oh my god. Daniel. This is so horrible. I, I feel sick. I need to get out of here. I'm so sorry, Daniel. Maybe we can save your soul at least. Yeah, figured when they, the camera started altering a little bit. You can't hurt me for this. Goodbye. Hopefully they can't uh, come on down from there. Yes, I can. Hold on! Hold on! Hold on! Hold on! Hold on! Hold on! Hold on. Oh god. Bought some time. Wait, the money! Then the knife! Good, it's fine. Need to heal. It's worth it. I have a knife now. Okay. In 1984, I'm not really sure what I'm looking at. Squish my guts. There's a lot of pictures here. Most of them are either blank or really out of focus. Now, last time you came out of this... Okay, don't do it again. Nice. Nice. Never weapon. This means we try fighting back against you. I saw it. Yep. Can you follow me in here or no? Because I said this was safe. Okay, you can't. Good. Now, we're going to put this back here. Because we only need one weapon at the moment. Save my game. There are some more items that I want to get. So we're not done here yet. Take the health kit. This was pushed over here. If you push it back, maybe this floorboard's a weak over here or something weird? Yes. More money. Nice. Also, a good key. Put you away. Put the house key away for the brief moment. May not need it right now. Oh! 
Boy, you trolled me. We're taking you down. We're taking you down. I'm tired of this. That was not an equal trade. Yes. Need a health pack. We're out of here. We're out. We need to get to the attic. So long, farewell! Okay, we have the attic key. We're gonna use this first. I need to break this here. Money! More money, nice. Billy. I'm sorry. Have a cleaver. It wants more. I don't know what we use this money for, but I like it. Take the cleaver. Probably does more damage than the knife. My estimation. Put the cleaver away. Take this. Heal up. Good. There is a lot of crates we can break up here. But let's not worry about just yet. Close up behind me, so I have some time if it comes after me. Boy, you really like to smile. Oh no, the cop died. It's a police uniform. Or was the cop... No, the cop was, uh... The killer. Bolt cutters. Okay. Put the attic key away. Let's go break some of these right here. Nice. Is there something hanging over there? Was that there before? What the? Oh, poor child. What? This wall is a liar. Have to dodge that. You can't stop me here. I'm in a safe room. It's official. Huh. Whoa! Whoa! You dead? Well, no, okay. Round two. You might explain to me why there was a prana plan in your place? In the basement. I'll be safest here. Hey, little guy. So here's where we gotta run for our life. Oof. We need to lose it. Or knock it down. I will be back for that health pack. Let's use the bolt cutters here, too. That's what we're dealing with in this area. Interesting. Looks like a cage. It almost looks like a photo of a person. Is this picture taken upside down? It looks like the thing we saw... Hello?
that was hanging that told us about the lying uh, photo. This car key would be useful. We can actually escape. So let's try... Let's see if we get an ending by just leaving early. Just taking the uh, car and getting out of here. Because we know Daniel's dead. I mean, I'm assuming there's an ending where maybe we save Daniel's soul. Nice, there's more money. But let's go for more of a normal ascending. Let's just see what's out here. Hmm. You can save our game out here. Ooh, the killer's here. I'm assuming the basement might be leads to give five of coins. Hey, cool. Nice. Well, this is totally worth it. Blue key. That's interesting. So the coins are more important than I thought. Okay, we're just gonna make a run for it. See if we can just get like a never ending of some kind. Just take the car, we can get out, not explore the basement. Speaking of what happened to our entrance over. Oh, I see. Later. Oh, are, are we gonna drive off? There you go, okay. I didn't really see a road coming in here, but that's fine. Blair Road. I drove out of the woods and eventually made it to Blair Road, but something seemed off. I drove on that road for hours without seeing another car, building a person. It didn't make any sense, and I eventually ran out of gas. There's no escaping, is there? They might show bronze certain items with me, like a weapon. Hello? Hello, I'm out of gas. I'm on Blair Road. Anyone there? Triple A? What do I do with my life? What the? No, there's a giant. Ah! Ending C. No escape. Try to get some coins. Ooh, a shovel. Sweet. I'm gonna use the bolt cutters here. Cause why not? Cause there's some money here anyways. So take that money. Then I'm just gonna kinda go and put these back. I may not need them for a bit. Shovel looks like it's just a weapon, but it's got 20 hits. That's pretty good. I'm gonna save that because I need it for like a boss. Okay, got some coins. What can you give me now? Nice. Another inventory upgrade? I'm not complaining. I keep wondering if that clock is having any use. Give me a hand. 
Alright, let's check spooky doll room. Get coins if we can. You never know if one's gonna lead to like a good item. Like this unique blue key we got. Need the basement key on that one. Lock the nearest side. Why? Why are you so determined to kill me? I'm gonna take these scissors. I'm gonna stab you. Get out of here. Leave me alone. Interesting. Do you read a dodge? Ah, I got stuck on you. Killer just sticks to you like damn glue. For whatever reason, you cannot cross into here. Which I find acceptable. Go away. You break that door open for me while you're at. Okay, now that you- well, there you are, never mind. Okay, nope, nope, no, no, you're gonna hit me. Oof. The dodge. Oof. Okay. I see why you stopped pursuing me in the one secret room. It's because uh, you're not supposed to go any further past this area. Now, the one ghost hidden at, there's a secret thing right here. Which there is. I'm not going to go into it yet in my initiate ending. We explore around a bit. There is a ladder. There's things that need heads. Let's check out the ladder first. Okay, this leads over to here. Great. We have one more coin. We could buy a new upgrade. Okay. Let's look around. Let's poke in this room a little bit. I don't want to go too far in. Basement within a basement? Come back to that. We need... Heads here. And there was a very long hallway here. A lot of weird statues. What? Oh god! The piranha plants. All of them are piranha plants. Hey, free coin. Thanks. Can you break these for me too? I wanna see if they drop coins. Oh god. Oh no. What is going on here? This can't be real. More prana plants? There's an axe. Do you want me to break these? What? What? I'm being attacked by children. Or a children that's used to half the person they used to be. I should use this somewhere. This statue's from a weird pattern. Are you? I just think these statues don't count as, uh, destruction. Go up. Hmm. Okay, I see how this works. Gotta be careful. A lot of children body parts around here. Can't trust children. Let's 
Okay, we were able to unlock that from the other side. There was something that needed basement key in here. Looks like there's a secret hallway right there, right? This is the, um, that U shape? That's what this was for. Pretty money. Hello. More money. Nice. Nice. Sickle. It has 25 uses. Wait, something happened. We got something. Got a head key. Now we can head out of here. Alright, let's explore in here. We haven't gone down here yet. Scary. Thanks for the, uh... Oh my god. What is going on here? No, no! Children! With knives! I'm gonna run around in circles and try to dodge them. Daniel? Oh my god, that's bad. Yeah, okay, that's it, buddy. No more Mr. Nice. Going down. I didn't have to kill you all, but I just felt like after a certain point it got really annoying. Okay, let's use the heads. Well, that's using your noggin. Hey, elf pack, thanks. Oh god, there's a giant evil head. I must sneak past you, could be secrets behind you. Reveal to me your secrets. You got teeth, man. You, you have some good chompers. I'm going to give you credit on that. Where do you go get your work done? <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, God! Ah! Oh god, oh god, oh god. Going north. Wanna go north or wanna go east? Oof, that was almost my head. I kind of tempted to go east, so I feel like there's secrets over there. You know what I mean? The good stuff. Hey, is there secrets down here? I'm gonna go down here, okay? Who got? What is the other side? Reveal your secrets to me. Can you eat that for me? Oh, the front of land down me. Okay, I saw this works. Don't touch, touch, don't touch. Oof. 
I swore that was going to give me a hit. Please don't be no prana plants right here. You need to be ready to dodge. Oh my god. Just barely. So we're definitely dealing with something that's a little more of a entity than uh Oh, did I win? Woman in the attic. I already actually met her. Thanks. I think this is an ending. Uh Anyone? Where am I? You can never leave. Newspaper stated October 31st, 1991. The police are requesting the public assistance in finding two children who were missing Thursday, October 10th. Police say Daniel and Claire Harrison were last seen heading into the Bluebell Woods. Police have suggested this case may be related to other disappearances that have happened in the province over the last decade. But Harrison's mother, Cynthia, had this to say. Any information at all helps, please, I just want my babies back home. If you have any information on the whereabouts of Daniel and Claire Harrison, please contact... The police at five 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 blah blah blah. Literally the last words. Ending B. Lost in the woods. Okay, let's go in here then. I'm not really sure if I need the basement key anymore, but I'm just dragging it with me. I see. This is a nod to another game they made, didn't they? I haven't played it, but I know from what this developer's created, they like that mouth and eye sprite. It's a handwritten note. It's June 1st, 2001. June 1st, 2001. That can't be right. Last night's dream. Feeling fuzzy again. But let's see. I think I was picking up Blair from school. But when I saw Blair, he looked like a teenager. Then he said to me, I'm too grown up for mommy to pick me up from school. And then he jumped into a sports car and drove off. Hopefully he'll be a bit more respectful to me than when he gets older. Than that. Thanks for a knife. So Blair lives on Blair Street. Probably hangs up the Blair Witch. Kind of just scouting out the area, seeing what I'm dealing with. I need the mystery key. Sounds very mysterious. The weapon has a pretty big swing range. Actually, so it doesn't hurt sometimes just to swing it. It will cover that entire hallway. Burning tree. A graveyard. I'll need the fence key over here. Let's go back and check out the southern route. Locked from your side, but it does have a photograph, and each photograph is either important or it hints at something important. So definitely want to get that. It's a painting of a dollhouse. It's a painting of a coffin. 
McDaniels behind there. Thanks. It's a handwritten note. It's dated August 21st, 2002. And every anxiety dream to add to the pile. They've been a lot more vivid lately. I'm in a weird space. There's a blue door far in the distance. Then suddenly I see Blair appear. He's standing by the door. I start to run towards him. I can see the door slowly opening, but I'm still so far away. There's something behind that door, but I don't know what. Before I know it, the door is shut and Blair is gone. So I was curious if the blue key opened the blue door. It was in the, um... It was up towards near the attic. And I tried it and didn't do it. But I could have been doing something wrong. I was going to come to it later. But that's, that was the obvious thing I possibly thought. Now you're saying weird. May 1st, 2002, my dream last night. My dreams have been so clear lately, but this one's a little fuzzy. I'm in someone's attic. There's candles everywhere. I'm sad about something. My body feels strange. I feel like I'm being hung upside down. That's all I really remember. Gotta make sure you always smash these. Could be secrets. Hey. Oh, oh. Actually. You want to come over here, buddy? This works for me. I think that's a fence key, probably. Okay. Whoa! Open this one first. That is Blair. It's a handwritten note. It's dated February 8th, 2002. Last night's dream felt like something out of a horror movie. I remember looking at a man wearing a grotesque mask. He was trying to talk to something. It wasn't human. It almost looked like a giant grin. I could tell he was kind of afraid of the thing. God, I'm getting chills just thinking about it. Oh great, I'm being attacked by children again. Let's loop around. I think there was a... Yeah. Let's take you out. I don't want to deal with you because I need to explore this area. So I'm, gonna, I'm just going to outright eliminate you. Cool. Liar wall. Interesting. We already broke that one. This wall is also a liar. We found that one too. Exactly. Have a note. It's a coffin. Oh god. The hanging thing. It's a painting of a coffin. So is the thing in the attic the... It could also be the same thing that chases you down at the end, too, in the one ending. The giant head. Ten row note, it's dated January 12, 2002. I never stressed dream last night. It's a funeral. I'm the only one there, and I'm standing by a dugout grave. The grave is small, it looks like a grave for a child. I'm crying so much, and my teeth are clenching uncontrollably. When I wake up, my mouth is in a lot of pain. I thought the grave was for Blair. Typical parental anxieties. But I've had this weird feeling that the funerals were never child. A child I've never met. Some very weird things going on here. So now we need to get the dollhouse. Daniel? So the other was Blair, this side's Daniel. It's a handwritten note, it's dated October 10th, 2001. 
Last night's dream, it was scary. I could see a house in the woods. The front door is missing and I can't get in. I don't know how, but I just know something horrible is happening inside. I'm panicking. I think I see someone through the second floor window. It looks like a young girl. She looks scared, so I call out to her. She doesn't notice me and then she disappears. Yeah, see, there's the mouth thing. It's a painting of a dollhouse. Well, that's a lot of dudes. I think I'll just leave you there. Mystery key. Leave me a phone, stabbing Daniels. I said, leave me alone. I will go in the safe room, you're not gonna like it. You want some? Yeah, that's right. Okay. Scary. Like, unapologetically so. I feel like I should bring more weapons. Let us get more weapons? No, never mind. Let's just go for it. But it really feels like it, right? The blue key. That's what it'd be for. Painting a blue door. I think I've seen this before. I can probably... Um... Uh, access the... <laughs> I ain't dealing with that. I'm currently dealing with that. Can I strike the head? No, it's definitely gotta be you. It works to my advantage. It targets whatever. It's a spirit of, like, consumption. Here, eat them. Yeah, that's right. Tasty. Tasty slasher villain meat. Where you running? Well, that's gonna hit me. How come I'm, how come you're the one running, huh? Aren't you supposed to be coming after me? Yeah, that's right. You get my point. Oh my god. He's finally dead. You fucking bastard. What the hell is that thing? Is it dead? 
Yeah, see, what is that area? Go away. Secret? No, 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 no. Looks like there's a secret back here. Never ending? Huh. Hello? Oh god! It's UFOs! It was UFOs all along! Alright, you damn UFOs. Carpal of an alien. They're not even real UFOs. They're fake ones. It was a dog all along. Bark. A dog. Bark, bark. You... You did all this. You're... Sorry. You... Didn't want Daniel to die. You... You were trying to help us. It... It's okay, doggy. You're a good boy. You tried your best. Bark, bark. I love you too, doggy. Bark, 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 bark. Ending E. Bark. Now we didn't even get ending D or A yet. No dog theme? Disappointed. Alright, let's try the blue key. Where am I? This is where uh, Daniel went when Daniel died. Daniel. Daniel? Sis. Someday, all this pain will end. Daniel, what are you talking about? I love you, sis. Daniel? What's going on? It's the rest of the newspaper. Claire was found by her mother several hours later, at 7.09 p.m., just outside of Bluebell Woods. Claire appeared to be in shock. She claimed she had found her brother's body in a strange house in the woods. During the search party, no house was discovered. There were also no records of a house being located within Bluebell Woods. The search party concluded later that evening at 11.30 p.m. Nothing substantial was discovered. If you have any information on the whereabouts of Daniel Harrison, please contact the police immediately. That's the end of the article. You went missing nine years ago to this day. 
I don't think there's been a single day since where I haven't thought of you. Mom and I miss you so much. When will this pain end, Daniel? Ending A. Goodbye, Daniel. Okay, there's the funnel coin. It was hidden up there this entire time. Let's see what we get for the funnel item we can buy. It will be never ending. Oh, you can go in your hideout. Okay. Uh, hand. Who are you anyway? Are you a, uh, handy person? Do you do any handy work? Hey, it's a Super Nintendo. The hand seems really happy and welcoming. I think it wants you to play video games. It's a CRT TV. What we got here? It's a video game console. The cartridge in the console is called Lamore Massacre Arcade Edition. It sounds kind of scary. But also kind of fun. I guess I'll play it. I mean, it will make the hand happy. Nice. Ending D. Vacation. And that's actually the last inning. So looking here, we've got all achievements except for the time related ones. And let's look at the shop. We can fairly buy everything. Um, I've unlocked a few things here. We can also be a dog. There's some of our weapons. Just gonna damn training here. So now we are a sheep. Nice. Oh man, it shoots a heart. Oh my god. This is amazing. Get out of here. It has unlimited uses too. You can't defeat a sheep. Amaho shows your sheep no less. Get out of here. Get. Get. For the power drill. Hey, don't attack dogs. Yeah, that's right. So that's it for Search Party Director's Cut. A fairly solid retro-style horror game. Gets a little weird sometimes. I don't fully understand the, the nature of the, the villain, per se, about Blair and everything, and what the entity of the mouth is, but maybe you're not supposed to. There was some weird time stuff going on there. There was some, some odd things happening, but they were happening. Now, I have not played the original, so I cannot compare it against it. I believe it's probably pretty similar. Except for the two secret endings and maybe some sprite changes? I'm not sure. I will say that some of the stealth... If, that's not really stealth, you more run around and you try to like... Escape the thing. I know it's supposed to be cock tower influenced. But sometimes it seems like there's not much you can do to get away, you just have to get to a safe room. I'd say like some of your options are a little bit limited. But aside from that, like I said, it's... A fairly solid, fairly solid little retro style horror game. Anyway. So, thank you all for watching play Search Party Director's Cut. 
I'll see you guys later and take it easy.